So this project behind me, they're doing a massive intersection rehabilitation project. They took down all the permanent traffic signals. We're using portable traffic signals through the duration of this seven month project. They're redoing the, the drainage system for this underpass that floods every time it rains. They're putting in a turn lane northbound coming off of uh, underpass road. This is one of the major crossings from the south side over the tracks. Probably sees 15, 20,000 cars on a normal day. I'm one of these more involved projects where we have, it's an in-town job and there's lots of traffic. You wouldn't be able to do it any other way than with these portable signals. We couldn't pound telephone poles and use span wire signals because it's a full reconstruct. There's just no place for them. We, we had to use something that was mobile so that we can move it as the project changes. It's a lot safer for these signals to be on the road than it is a flagger with this much traffic every day. You can't get around this, the safety aspect of the signals. Is It's a lot safer for the public, the traveling public. It's a lot safer for the workers. During each phase of the project, we've had to move the signals several times. As the project moves, so do the signals. Of the many challenges on a project of this size, managing pedestrians, bicyclists, and ADA compliance uh, is becoming increasingly important on projects like this. So you can see we set up a temporary crosswalk system, in this case, about 100 yards uh, to the west of that signalized intersection. And we're giving the pedestrians a protected crosswalk to get across. We're using push button technology. You can see it's on a temporary cart there and all the other features of a normal crosswalk system. Once they push that button, they're getting the traffic to stop with red lights overhead, and then it's on a timer, giving the pedestrians enough clearance time to get across this four-lane highway. And then once they are across, traffic resumes as normal. There are times when we need to put all traffic signals on red, and you can call the call center and they can do it or you can use the app on your phone. If it's for a short amount of time, you can, you can pick up your phone and turn all signals to red, to flash and red, to flash and yellow. So our job as traffic control is to make sure that the traveling public is safe, that the, the workers are safe, and to keep traffic flowing the way it's supposed to. It's really important for the prime contractor to be able to do his job, I have to do my job correctly. I don't know how people would do it without portable signals, I mean, honestly. Like, they're just so much more convenient than something that's stationary, that something's on a pole. Like, everything changes, things have to be moved, and you have to be ready for it.